it was getting ready to go to jail. He had called me like, hey, you want you trying to shoot the video? I'm like, hell yeah. So he's like, I'll be out there on Wednesday. I shoot it Wednesday. And that was before jail. And that's before he went to jail. Yeah, we on boss talk one on one. Man, so when you when you when you think about like I said the the come up scene like you was you was linked with uh uh the game yeah I came up to the game yeah so yeah. did you take that nigga to the hoop or what nah he good in basketball that nigga good in basketball <laughs> <laughs> he good in basketball he good at rapping you feel me yeah, yeah. He, he can't fuck that boy be rapping man yeah. that's one of them ones right there like Facts. when you think of this place right here this nigga is like yeah nah I, he the only nigga I seen. In my eyes, the 50 Cent had issues like, this nigga was crazy. You know? yeah, and and would just go. Like, he, he just, half of the time, we didn't even know, like, what the fuck was going to happen next. You feel me? Really? Come out of his room, you just see what's happening. Like, damn. You, when did y'all link? How old was you? I linked with Game probably in, I was about 19. 19? Yeah. This is really when he was uh, getting this shit with Dr. Dre. Yeah. So we had a mutual friend, too. Shout out to Michael Hunt. Okay. We played ball together and shit like that. So, uh, you know, I was had an influence in the hood and the streets and shit like that. So they was really telling me to just come fuck with them. You feel me? Just come hold them down because they wanted, you know, some real niggas around them. Yeah. So that's kind of how I really got in there. And I was playing sports at the time for, like, Southwest College. Okay. And then um, I just fell in love with the music. Man. And... Then, and the rest is history, huh? Right. Like, like when you when you think about the you you in the in like the 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 South, the you for some reason Lil Wayne and them have a real connection to yeah. this L.A. culture. Right. When I look at Birdman and them, and, and and I've interviewed people, and I always be like, dang, how they they love the L.A. culture. They they lived out the blood yeah. and all that. The the colors, they 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 whole setup is it, it it's funny because they named Cash Money after that movie. Yeah. But then, <laughs> that's in New York. But then you end up looking like the people of L.A. You know what I'm saying? Do you ever think about yeah. that? Shout out to Birdman. <laughs> See, so, Wayne, yeah, Wayne, Wayne a good dude. Wayne a good dude. Wayne, me and Wayne had a relationship before me and Birdman did. Yeah, y'all did. Wayne is a good dude, man. So Wayne, like, like you guys, like when you look at Birdman and that whole. They had a, uh, was it, you was with them before they did the, uh, what they called the Cash Money uh, West Coast? Well, or did you, yeah, was, you was before that, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah facts. Yeah, so um, how did y'all end up, you know, even putting it, it had to be with the game or something? No, nah, no, nah, it wasn't. It wasn't? No, nah, no. Nah. It was uh, oh. just, I think I was on the road somewhere, and then I ran into Birdman, and he was telling me that he really wanted to fuck with me. It was my situation. So after that, we had chopped it up, and uh, probably like a month later, I was on the road with Birdman, and we was just, you know, getting in, building on the music, having a bunch of conversations, and he was telling me, like, there's too many rappers in there, ain't no CEO, that's why niggas ain't getting looked out for, that's, that's why this and this, you feel me? So I kind of, I did my project that I was supposed to do with him, but after that, it was, um, you know, the option, so I kind of took that to come back and build with, you know, my people, and, and what we up to now, you feel me? But wow. Birdman and uh, Wayne, you know, they did so much for me in every different way you can think about it, you know. I got to respect them forever. Yeah, like, like it's not, I talked to King Noah. He's the guy that rock with them. You heard, you know King Noah? Yeah. Them, they've been on my show. They always show me love, man. It's people that have been around him from Nikki, Natural, to everybody that's mm -hmm. been around him. God keeps putting me into Mr. People yeah. that rock with him. I know I get to interview him one day. Yeah, you know right, what I'm saying? Because right. I, I, I'm like, man, I'm a big, she know I am about mm -hmm. bird, man. Yeah. Like, this nigga boss, I love boss nah, talk. You know what I'm saying? Too. So it's like, this dude here, man, and everybody's story be like that, yeah. you know? And it's like genuine, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, like you you did, how did the song come about the, with, with Lil Wayne? Um, I had, really, me and Wayne was real close at this time so game would have me um hit him up so he could get verses from wayne so one day i'm like fuck it i hit him for myself oh you know what I mean? so he did the, um he did the verse for me and then he was getting ready to go to jail he had called me like hey you want you trying to shoot the video i'm like hell yeah 
So he's like, I'll be out there on Wednesday. I shoot it Wednesday. And that was before jail. And that's before I went to jail. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101.